Welcome to my channel, The Colors of Mathematics. So I have brought before you another interesting problem of factorization. If you look at this problem carefully, it is a quadratic and it involves the middle term splitting. So here we can see that the sum should be negative 2 under root 2 and the product should be negative 30. So let's just go ahead and write factor pairs of 30, negative 30. So we have 10 times 3. Let's just write the factor pairs of 30 and we'll put the negative sign later on. 5 into 6, then we have 15 into 2 and we have 30 into 1. But none of these seem to serve our purpose because in the sum we have under root 2. So here we can use one manipulation that 2 can be written as product of under root 2 into under root 2. How does this work? We know under root 2 is 2 raised to power 1 by 2. So the bases are same. So you, according to the rules of exponents, the powers have to be added, which makes it 2 raised to power 1 equal to 2. So we are going to use this green thing equation in making the uh, splitting the uh, middle term. So let's do it. Let's just take the first pair that is 10 into 3 and let's just erase all the other pairs and look at this. Now 10 can be written as 2 into 5 into 3 and 2 can be written as look at the green equation under root 2 into under root 2 into 5 into 3. Now further manipulation we can write it as 5 under root 2 into 3 under root 2. So when we multiply these 2 under root 2 under root 2 into under root 2 it will become 2. So the whole multiplication would give us 30 only. So now what do we want? We want negative 30. So which of these two factors should be negative? So that would be decided by looking at the sum. And the sum should be negative 2 under root 2. So that means we want a negative sum. So that means the bigger factor has to be negative. So we keep negative 5 under root 2. Uh, this factor is negative and the other factor is positive. So that the sum is negative 2 under root 2. And now let's look at the product again. Negative 5 under root 2 into 3 under root 2 gives us negative 30. So let's put this in our expression and see what do we get. So here we come back to our expression and we get we split the middle term into two parts and we group them and we take out the common factors. Here we can see the common factor is x. So I take out x under root 2. Yes. But here what should I take out? Uh, because I want the factors in the brackets to be same. So I can just take out the whole coefficient of x. So when I take out 3 under root 2. I am left with x. But what am I going to get here? Look at this. When you divide negative 30 by 3 under root 2, you get negative 5 under root 2. So here I'm going to write negative 5 under root 2 and I take out the common factor expression and I get two factors x minus 5 under root 2 and x plus 3 under root 2. So I hope it is clear. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.